Hello, everybody. Once again, uh, I'm going to put up Mark Colley in time from the movie The Punisher. Uh, there have been quite a few of y'all to suggest that I might do this so that you can pick up on the strum pattern a little more. Y'all know the chords, because I'm trying to let everything I put up here be easy chords. So, um, but the strum pattern is giving y'all some difficulty, and you're wanting to get a little more accurate with that. I will say this. Right? If it's just you and your guitar, chances are nobody's going to notice that you're not quite matching Mark Cowley strum for strum. They didn't just come in from listening to the sound, movie soundtrack, or they didn't just get done watching the movie and pause it right there and make you play along. So, um, I try to do everything I can as accurately as possible, but in the end, the places I perform, it's usually just me and my guitars. I don't have anybody else playing up there with me. So, um, I try to get as close as I can. I want everybody to hear what they're used to hearing on the radio when they heard the original recordings. But if I don't get it quite exactly right, I don't lose too much sleep over it. So, um, by all means, try to get it right. Obviously, the, the more, more accurate you are with it, the better it's going to sound. But if you aren't exact, I don't really think anyone's going to sweat you for it. So, But here we go. I will slow it down. Now, y'all pardon me because what's happening, and this is only the like, fourth time I've tried recording this already this morning. Um, because I'm trying to strum slower... I am now paying more attention to my strumming, which is something I really don't really do, instead of the chord changes. So I'm going to be not paying attention down here as much, right there. I'm going to be paying attention up here to my music, which looks like this. And then... Um, Y'all just follow along with this right here. Don't pay attention to this. Don't pay attention to this. Uh, I'll have the chords up here, of course, somewhere as, as always. So here we go. Mark Colley, In Time, from the Punisher movie soundtrack. I can hear what you're thinking. All your doubts and fears And if you look in my eyes In time you'll find The reason I'm here And in time all things shall pass away In time you may come back someday To live once more or die once more But in time your time will be no more You know your days are numbered Count them one by one Like notches in the handle of an outlaw's gun you can outrun the devil if you try But you will never outrun the hands of time In time there'll surely come a day In time all things shall pass away In time you may come back some say To live once more or die once more But in time your time will be no more I can hear what you're thinking. So there we go. I like this thing. It sounds so nice. If you'd have told me years ago I'd ever own one of these little curved-backed, curved arch-backed 
turtle shell guitars. I was like, no way, I'll never have a plastic guitar. Of course, the front still would. But, uh, yeah, I just, I love playing this thing. So here we go. Um, go ahead and stop here if you want to go back and start all over again and, and uh, continue on. Or if you're like, okay, I got this now. Well, here we go. Full speed ahead. I can hear what you're thinking. All your doubts and fears. And if you look in my eyes in time, you'll find the reason I'm here. And in time, all things shall pass away. In time, you may come back someday to live once more or die once more. But in time, your time will be no more. You know your days are numbered. Count them one by one. Like notches in the handle of an outlaw's gun. You can outrun the devil if you try. But you will never outrun the hands of time In time there'll surely come a day In time all things shall pass away In time you may come back some say To live once more Or die once more but in time, your time will be no I can hear what you're thinking. There it is. Have some fun with it. If uh, there's something else y'all still have questions about, by all means, um, let me know in the comments or uh, uh, send, send me a, a message or something, I suppose. Y'all can email me. Um, I will try. I've done it with maybe one or two songs, but I will try, I've shown y'all my music here, uh, I will try to go ahead and start putting that in the description so that you will be able to either take a screenshot of it if you're looking at your cell phone and then go ahead and blow it up and have it printed out so it'd be full-size music. Um, I'm planning on making a, a book available and uh, it depends, I gotta see how much cost is gonna be involved in print and everything else, paper, binders, the whole nine yards. Something that you can set up on a music stand that's not going to keep trying to close up on you while you're trying to... I've done everything from Galligator clips, you name it. None of that works. You know what? Put it in a binder. It lays out flat. And uh, I'm going to try to make that available. We'll see how that goes. Until next time, be good to each other. Keep on keeping on. Take care.